Sir, you've been out of Ah, yeah, and I've been good, my dear. How you been doing, you all right? Oh, I've been good, but my children, I worry about my children, you know, because uh, drugs. Ah, it's a dangerous thing, yeah, eh? Oh, drugs is yeah. no good, sir. Uh, I can kill you. It, that's right. Yeah, especially at a night time. <laughs> Why are drugs particularly bad at the night time? What do you think about it? If you can't see it and you hit it, <laughs> you die. Hit the what? The drugs. <laughs> Sam, I'm talking about drugs. You're talking about trucks. But you need the drugs to deliver the drugs. <laughs> Do you know anything about drugs? Oh, of course I know plenty of this thing. I Have you heard of pee? Oh, have I heard of this? Yes, very bad. That's right. Oh, I was breaking up communities, organizations, federation, corporation, insurrection. <laughs> That's right, Sam. Well, yeah, is very no bad. Good, Sam. Yeah, no, picking up families, everything. Yeah, that's yeah. right, Sam. It's bad. That's right. Beer for mm. bad. <laughs> yep. Yep, this is a very bad thing. <laughs> What's a B again? B is methamphetamine. <clears throat> oh, those are the two guys that make the B. What? You know, methamphetamine. <laughs> no. P stands for methamphetamine. P is short huh. for methamphetamine, Sam. Ah, well, there you go. Why? They were on P when they make the methamphetamine. <laughs> Why? Because methamphetamine starts with M. <laughs> you know, it's like if I said to my family, ladies and gentlemen, my name is John, but you can call me H. <laughs> no good? Yeah, well, you know, it's not just a P that's bad. You know, there's oh. also cannabis. That's how they start off. They start off with cannabis. No, no, why, why, what's wrong with that thing? Cannabis is illegal. You know, the family up illegal. the road. Illegal? Yeah, the family up the road, they got arrested last week oh. by the police because they had cannabis in the back of their house, Sam. It's illegal? It's against the law to have cannabis, Sam. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> why? Well, just last week, I was at my granddaughter's birthday. Yeah. We were all eating and drinking underneath the cannabis at the back of the house of my... <laughs> oh, man. No. Oh. Hey, Sam. No. <laughs> that is a cano... That is a cano pee. I thought one pee was bad enough. Now they have a cano pee. <laughs> Sam. What is this world coming for? <laughs> Oh, my cost. <laughs> Sam, you should be reading the news, you know. I'm, I read the news. Okay, well, you should be up to date with what's happening yeah, in the I world. Yeah, I know. I know all these things happening. Okay, well, let me ask you one question, sir. <clears throat> ask it, ask it. <laughs> Have you heard of bird flu? Have you heard of fish swim? Okay, maybe we shouldn't talk about those things, okay? Yeah, okay, I'm sorry. Okay, let's... I, it was your granddaughter's birthday last week. I, I, I thought you had another celebration last week. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah, sorry. Uh, yeah. <clears throat> we didn't want to invite you. I... Uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, what we... What was it? Um... <clears throat> oh, sorry. <clears throat> was it you and your wife have an anniversary? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Well, I never got invited. Oh, we didn't want you to be there. I, yeah. You always send me an invitation. Yeah, it's, not, it's not a personal thing. Oh. Yeah, it's just between us two. <laughs> so, were well, you going to send me an invitation? Yeah, next week. <laughs> Is it, it doesn't matter. As long as you know that's the main thing. <laughs> well, thanks, mate. <clears throat> yeah. It's the fault that counts. Yeah. Eh? And I thought you were there. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, you, you, we, last week, you know, me and my wife, hey. we celebrated our 42 in the anniversary. 
<coughs> Sam, uh, that's 40 seconds. <laughs> Sometimes I wish it only lasted for 40 seconds. <laughs> No, 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 serious, no serious. What? We celebrate our 42 empty anniversary. <laughs> yeah. Sam, yeah. tell me, what is ND? Do you know? What? It's the letters after the numbers. What? You know, like a 500 BC. <laughs> 2000 AD is like what? <laughs> okay, Sam, tell me. Uh, what does BC stand for? Before card. <laughs> <laughs> and AD stands for? After dinosaurs. <laughs> so, so your ND yeah. stands for? Uh, no divorce. <laughs> uh, Hey, no drama. Oh. Ah, yeah. No <laughs> trouble. Ah, <laughs> no what? That's it. That's it. That's all I have. Yeah. So tell me, Sam. Uh, what is the key? Uh, what is the secret uh, to, to, to your marriage lasting for 42 years? This is no secret. This is no key. Hey. Just a simple old-fashioned true love. Oh. Yeah, yeah. Oh. You know, I, I, I give my wife her space. You know, I try and give her as much space as she wants. Mm. You know, because she needed it. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, no. Serious. No, serious. 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 <laughs> serious. No, she's not that. <laughs> no, serious. 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 <laughs> No, you know, I, 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 I put my wife up there. On a pedestal, huh? Oh, it's up to you. <laughs> no, I, 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 I think highly. Oh, I think highly of well, my wife. Well, that's the secret. Yeah. That's the key. You think highly of your yeah, wife. Yeah, I think highly. You know Halle Berry? Hey. <laughs> <laughs> I think of her as my wife. <laughs> no, no, I'm no, serious. No, serious. I love my wife. Oh, cool. uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, I, I love my yeah, wife. Well, yeah. you should love your wife. Of course, you know, because of course. if you didn't marry her, yeah. you would still be an overstayer in New Zealand. Oh, oh uh, come on, oh, man. Oh, wow. hey, oh, come, come on. on. Hey, hey, hey. hey. That's so a low is... blow, oh, man. Well, you know. oh, no. hey, look, yeah. I'll give you an invitation next time. Okay. Hey. Good, good. But oh. tell me, sir. I'm How sorry. come you never oh. got caught when yeah. they were doing the dawn raids in the early 70s? The oh, immigration uh, department come knocking on your door. How come they never caught you? It's, it's, it's a family secret. Oh, yeah, yeah. what's your family secret for not getting caught by the immigration department? You have to learn how to get a flask yourself. <laughs> so how did you get a flask yourself? Well, I pretend I was one of the local, you know, local people. So how did you do that? Well, I, uh, for example, for example, um, hey, hey. the immigration officer has come to my house. Hey. He will knock it on my door. Hey. I will open the door and I will greet him like I am one of the locals. Well, what do you say? Oh, I shake the hand hey. and I say, Kia ora. <laughs> hey. yeah. And then what do you do after you say Kia ora? Well, then after that we do the hangi. <laughs> What's the hangi? You know, the greeting of the noses. Oh, and how do you do a hangi? Well, say the hand. Uh. <laughs> sir, 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 sir. Uh, so, uh, so, 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 why do Maori greet with the nose? Well, so that he knows and I knows <laughs> that we are one. Blah. That you are one tongue, we are one tongue a <laughs> Sam, Sam, that's a, a hongi, it's not a hangi. Oh no, that's further down south, that's further down south. <laughs> yeah. You see, this is the trouble, you don't know the difference between hangi and hongi. You don't know how to speak Māori. What do you say to oh. them after you do the... the I can't find it on Māori, then. So what do you say to them? 
Or I speak to them in uh, Maori. Yeah. I say to them, <coughs> come, mate, come, mate. <laughs> oh, it's cold, cold. Ten like the tangata, blah, blah. Hey, it's impossible. Yeah, but it's very simple. Hey, uh. <laughs> Now, you see, what happens if they ask you what tribe you're from? You don't know any Māori tribe. You don't know if you're Ngāti Paro, Ngāti Kahungunu. What Ngāti would you be? Well, I say to them, I am Koko Ngāti. <laughs> hey. oh. And then they will be able to trace my whakapapa <laughs> from there, you know? Oh, who's <laughs> Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. That's right. Oh, speaking of fucker, Papa uh, Asa. Yeah. In Christmas, <clears throat> oh. I'm, I'm thinking of, I'm going to take my Parangi friend to uh, Samoa. Oh, awesome. Yeah, we're just going to go for a break. Huh? <laughs> oh, you're a funny choker, man. What? Uh, you see, a Parangi can go to Samoa for a break. Hey. A Samoan will go to Samoa for a break. <laughs> hey. You know, I'm a veteran when it comes to travel to Samoa. Hey. You see, I never take my good clothes. <laughs> because I understand Samoa is a very magical country. <laughs> you know, what goes to Samoa stays in Samoa. <laughs> <laughs> hey, hey. That's why I'm thinking of taking my wife over there. <laughs> <laughs> no serious, no serious, no serious. I love, I love her. Good. Uh, yeah. Good. <laughs> yeah. Uh, well, yeah. you know what, Sam? I think you might be right. Uh, I think we won't go to Samoa for Christmas. Yeah. Because Bob always goes camping, so I'm just going to go camping with oh. Bob and his family. So what's our camping? What's oh, our well, you camping? know, we go down by the sea, you uh, build a hut by the sea, you sorry. catch the fish, you go into the forest, get the firewood, cook in an open fire, you know, wash your clothes in the river, dry it in the sun. You should come camping with us, I think. <sighs> Have you ever wondered why I leave Samoa and come to New Zealand? <laughs> why? Ah, uh, because I've been camping all my life. Oh, look at you, <laughs> eh? Look at you. Oh, 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 oh wow. -wee. <laughs> well, I think you might be right, Sam. Yeah, I think I, I better I, just stay at home stay. and watch the rugby. Yeah. I like the oh. rugby. I really enjoy the rugby this year, Sam. Eh. You know, because of the new law they bring in last year. When oh. you tackle somebody, eh. roll away. Tackle, roll away. Ch the ball comes out faster. Tackle, roll, tackle, roll, roll away. Tackle, roll, roll, roll away. Roll. Chuckle, oh, oh, oh. roll away. <laughs> oh, wow. Chuckle, roll, roll away. Oh, yeah. Yeah. It's, uh, yeah. it's good. It's yeah. good for rugby. It's very good for rugby. Well, you know that the new law uh, is starting to sound a lot more like my marriage. <laughs> oh, what's yeah. that? Well, for assemble, for assemble. Uh, no, last night. Uh, no, I try and spice things up with a while. <laughs> <laughs> so I sneak up on my wife. <laughs> <laughs> and then I check on my wife. Oh, what happened? She said to me, run away, run away! <laughs> and <laughs> nothing spicy about that. <laughs> 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 So you got sent off? Uh? Hey, I only got suspended. <laughs> hey. Well, maybe you should protest against your suspension, sir. Oh, what's that thing, the protest? Well, you know, there are different ways you can protest. Oh, like a what? Like a what? Well, I don't know. Go on a hunger strike? Hunger <laughs> 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 <I got> strike? Hunger <laughs> <Yeah. I got> strike? <laughs> Is that a real thing? <laughs> Yes, 
people actually refuse to eat. Refuse. They are, yeah, they give them food. They say, no, I'm not going to eat for days and oh days, Sam. Gosh. Yeah, to try and make a point, Sam. Refuse to eat to make a point. Yes. Well, you know what I think if you refuse to eat? Mm. The only point you make is that you are stupid. <laughs> huh? If I was to go on hunger strike, mm. it would be like if I, uh, if I walk into the bank with a can in my hand and say to the lady behind the counter, if you don't give me the money, I will shoot me. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Oh, did it. Okay, so a hunger strike is no good for you. Oh, no kidding. <laughs> well, you can just go on a march. <laughs> First you tell me not to eat, now you tell me to go for a long walk? <laughs> well, what are you trying to say? <laughs> huh? What? I need a new shoes? Okay, okay. <laughs> no, no. Uh, well, 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 you don't have to march. Sometimes you can just write your message on a banner, and then you hold oh, the banner yeah. up. And that's how you protest. Yeah, yeah. I've seen that thing before. Oh. I remember I saw a march. They wrote the message on the pen, and then they shot the message that was on the pen. I felt like saying to them, hey, keep it down. I can read the pen. <laughs> but then I thought to myself, because I can't think for anybody else, I thought, my be, my be, <laughs> they write the message on the banner is to remind the leader of what he has to say. <laughs> you think it? <laughs> because I always hear the leader say, what do we want? <laughs> and you feel like saying to him, ah, uh, it's just up here, man. <laughs> And then you hear him say, when do we want it? You feel like saying to him, ah, you wrote it this morning, man. <laughs> yeah. I think it's an Australian thing. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> well, you know, that's right. But you know, even after you watch the rugby, you still want to watch more sports. So sometimes uh, I just switch it over to the other sports channel. Oh. ESPN. Oh, uh, yeah, the ESPN, ESPN channel. <laughs> ESPN. I know how to pronounce it. There's no need to spell it out. ESPN, ESPN channel. Oh, okay. <clears throat> now, have you seen the extreme games that uh, they play? Have you I? You know those boys come down on a skateboard, yeah. they go up on the ramp, they spin and they land. And there, swim. You know, they come on a, on a bike, they spin on the ramp and they land. Oh, uh, yeah. It's amazing. Uh, it's yes. incredible. It's Phenomenal. Ah, it's astronomical. <laughs> it's extraordinary. Ah. <laughs> ah. <laughs> I agree with you. <laughs> yeah. Now, I remember when I first watched that Eskin. Mm. It was an Australian boy. Mm. He was riding his skateboard down the world's largest, most gigantic skateboard ramp in all of the, the world. <laughs> he was doing this in front of a hundred and thousands of Australian people. He was coming down his skateboard so fast. It was like, fast? <laughs> then he come to the top of the ramp. Something was happening. <laughs> the boy was called One Direction. The skateboard went another direction. <laughs> the boy, as you could see, it was a simple miscalculation of mass plus velocity. <laughs> uh, uh, geography, geography. <laughs> <laughs> the boy start to ascend, then he stop, and he start to <laughs> the opposite of ascend. <laughs> All the Australian people was react like, oh, oh, oh my gosh, dude, what's going to happen? <laughs> the boy was start to come down and punch his hands and kick his feet, like it was going to make a difference. <laughs> the Australian people start to react like, oh, shivery tempers. <laughs> Oh, hug me a koala and call me a didgeridoo. <laughs> the boy was coming down faster and faster. 
The Australian people couldn't watch it anymore. <laughs> and then when the boy hit the ground, boom! All the Australian people was like, When I was watching the TV and he hit the ground, I thought to myself, oh, what a stupid idiot. <laughs> but then I thought to myself, imagine, imagine <laughs> if that was a salmon boy. <laughs> imagine if that happened in front of a hundred and thousands of salmon people. I could imagine the salmon boy would start to ascend. Then he would stop, and he would start to, to proceed. <laughs> and as soon as that would happen, the salmon people's reaction would be like, oh. <laughs> hey, hey, what happened here? Hey, hey, hey. The salmon boy will start to kick his feet and punch his head. And all the salmon people will react like, Oh, well, are you a bird now? Are you going to fly away? Huh? All right. Are you Superman or something like that? <laughs> and then she falls down faster and faster. <laughs> all the salmon people will be like, Go, 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 go. <laughs> and then as soon as he hits the ground, boom. All the salmon people will react like, oh, yeah, number one idiot right there. <laughs> but as I was watching the television, I saw the Australian mom run up to the, the Australian boy. When I saw the Australian mom, I thought, wow, that's a loving mom. <laughs> that's a nurturing mom. That's a caring mom. <laughs> He's a pretty mom. Oh, yeah. <laughs> the mom ran up to his son and said, Oh. <laughs> She ran up to her son and said, son, any limbs broken? Do you need a paramedics or anything like that? Are you all right? When I saw that, I thought, that's, that's a number one mom. That's, a, that's a excellent. Then I thought to myself, imagine. Imagine if that was a salmon mom. I can imagine the salmon mom will run. Well, she will try her best. <laughs> but when she ran to her son, it would be like. <laughs> and then she will finish off her drumstick. She would run up to her son, but her son was only two meters away from where she was standing. <laughs> she would go up to her son and say, son, hey son, let me catch my breath. <laughs> Three hours later, the salmon mom would be like, son, is anything's broken on you? Because if it's not, I'm going to break every single bone in your body. Yeah. <laughs>